Hey guys, it's John, and welcome to my playthrough of Haunted Cities by Kitty Horror Show. A lot of people asked me to play more Kitty Horror Show games after I played Anatomy a couple days ago. If you haven't checked that video out, link is in the description. Um, this is actually a collection of very short games that Kitty Horror Show created for her Patreon supporters. There's a link to her Patreon in the description also. I believe that you get uh, these games as a reward for pledging $5 a month or more. So if you're interested, the link to that is in the description. This particular one is called Leech Bowl. Now I think that these are pretty short, so I'm not sure how long this one will be, but there are two more that we're gonna be playing uh, in this video. Oh, Botfly Road. That's an interesting name. This is a cool city, man. I wouldn't mind living here. Oh, okay. So every street you go down gets a name. Oh, a bottle full of blood. Leech meal. I guess I should bring it with me? <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay, uh, I'm not gonna be talking much in this video, by the way. It's just not that type of game that demands a lot of talking. In fact, it's uh, quite the opposite. Oh. Oh. I can... What? Ocean would spill out. You and you just open up. Wait. <laughs> I'm really bad at reading that typeface, apparently. Getting uh, hidden messages, apparently. Oh. Okay. I guess you're supposed to throw the leech meal at buildings and uncover hidden messages? That... That, uh, skin of yours... seems awful tight. I think I like my skin the way it is. Oh god. I did not splatter anything here. What is this over here? Somebody's been splattering blood... In my absence, this is Leech Bowl Road. Hmm. Let's go a little faster. This seems promising. I'll save this blood. I'm not sure where we can throw it. Huh. I wonder if there's any way in. Or what, what this place even is. It looks like a power plant of some kind. I'm pretty sure not. Huh. It got everywhere, didn't it? Okay. Well... We'll just keep exploring, I guess. There's nothing here for you but a place between our teeth. Okay, good. I think this is actually where I started right here. Maybe? Maybe not? Okay, so there are three different radio towers. Cholera Avenue. Nice. Oh, we can go in here. can't pick up the uh, blood in this this store but it is everywhere I guess this is a city full of leeches uh, it doesn't look like we can go anywhere else in here brush grip typeface nice for their sake seek our mouths in the soil crawl between our teeth 
It's like there's those are like trash bags full of blood. She may look clean, but her flesh remains her own. Her mind remains her own. Find her or hollow her. She will not go unfed. Or we will not go unfed. Hollow her, huh? No child can resist the glory of the divine pus. I don't have five cents. Damn. Meat is what you're made of. Keep that in mind. Crying won't help you. Nothing will help you. Your only hope for purpose is to feed them. Gorge yourself on blood. Never stop. I can hear her blood. She is turgid with it. What are her secrets? All right, so a lot of blood suckers here. There's something over here. Looks like there's a structure in the distance. There's a road that leads out here. It doesn't open. Huh. Found a key. Found a key. I never looked behind there when I first came in. Okay, farmhouse, here we come. So I actually painted the entire town red with leech blood because I was like, maybe you just have to throw leech blood at all of the houses and then it'll automatically open this place up because this is the one place I can't get into. Uh, there's also that power plant, but it doesn't seem like there's an entrance. This actually has a locked entrance, so I think we can get in now. At least I hope we can. Made it. So, here we go. stuff is everywhere. I thought we went into the farmhouse, but I I guess not. I can barely see. There's flesh blocking everywhere. Come on, I need to get in there. Is there no entrance? baby girl <laughs> and the game stopped it crashed it uh it crashed on purpose though uh, for some reason a lot of people had difficulty with this when i played anatomy every time i said it crashed i think a lot of people thought i was like saying it was a glitch or something I thought it was pretty clear that it, it crashed on purpose. I want to see what happens if I load up again, because that's what we did with uh, anatomy. But I think that might be it. 
Yeah. Same thing, I think. Um, okay, let's play one of the other ones. All right, guys, so this is Grandmother, and it's the other horror game in the Haunted Cities pack. There's another game called Pente, but it's more of kind of a fantasy setting. And this, I know you guys probably want to see the horror stuff. If you want to play that one, though, you're free to, you know, download it and try it yourself. Enter Barn, okay? So this is supposed to be kind of reminiscent of a 3D DOS game. Not really sure what to expect here. Hi, ladder. Can I climb you? No. Hmm. Let's go ahead and exit the barn. <sighs> Where'd that come from? Uh, out in the forest? I kinda don't wanna go. Is there anywhere else to go? Hopefully there is. This is a little path that leads out somewhere. Let's follow the path. I thought that fence was a monster. Okay, let's see. Here we go, here's the door. In our house. Maybe we'll turn the TV back on. I guess we found grandmother. Disturbing art on the walls as always. So this is tank controls and um, just got the mouse pointer and that's it. So can't adjust, read book. You open to a random page. The boy came to a clearing where a great bloated tick wallowed in a shallow pond, and he found that he could not speak, for she had filled his mouth with leeches as he was running through the swamp. Press space to continue. And that's it. You open to a random page. You will know that you have come to the kingdom of the Hierophant, for the roaches will have the teeth of men, and the wasps will not have not stingers but tongues, and the worms will twist themselves into knots until they are torn and bleeding. The man walked, driven like cattle, by the tower's groans, and with each step he took a new worm, uh, penetrated the sole of his foot, until he was not but a suit of skin for their family, teeming and boiling at the holes of his eyes. The priestess sank into the mud, which whispered to her as it filled her ears, and she felt his oils and secrets slide across the wrinkled flesh of her brain, and she shivered and the knife burrowed under her ribs. Alright, Grandma, you got weird taste in literature. I'll say that much. Anything else in here? Grandma, this isn't much of a living space. What's this? Take knife? What? What do I need the knife for? You got big hands, Grandma. No, but seriously, what do I need the knife for? We'll exit the house. Eesh. Okay, and we'll just let's see. Path goes this way for a bit. Uh, dude, I don't know. I'm not really sure where this goes. Here's a clearing right here. I think I'm gonna. Ah, oh, crap! I need to go back. I think. 
great uh, sound effects in the background. Pretty cool. Here's a lamp, thanks. Is it just Grandma's house in the barn that's available? Just wondering what I got. Yeah, there's the barn right there. I got it. I was there earlier and there was nothing to be found. Hmm. the hell? What is this? I have a knife. I don't know why I'm saying that. It's not really good for anything. This looks like if Jupiter was like a cylinder. Holy. Uh, okay. Man, I don't... What else do I do here? What? Kill murderer? Kill lecher? Kill blasphemer? Think murderer? Where's, uh, the door to Grandma's house? Okay then. Which house is yours? Ah, uh, <laughs> what? I wonder if you get a different result based on who you decide to murder? Alright guys, uh, so I decided to kill the lecher, and it seems like the same thing happens, so I'm not sure if there's any difference between the three. But uh, yeah, those were some short uh, Kitty Horror Show games. Uh, once again, the Patreon is in the description, and um, I'm not sure how many more uh, of the games that are currently released I'm going to play on the channel, just because a lot of them are very, very experimental, and um, some of them are even like uh, text games, basically. Uh, or at least one of them is. And... Um, you know, I'm anatomy was really good, but I think I might wait until the next uh, purchasable game comes out to play some more. So hopefully uh, you guys enjoyed this anyway, though, and see you guys later. Incredible.